Hey everyone, in this channel you will see a lot of tablescape, home decorating, shopping halls, drifting halls, a little bit of DIY, home tour, and a little bit of flower arranging. Hey guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Glamour Ellen. If you're new here, welcome to my channel. And if you're a returning subscriber, welcome back. Everyone, in this video, I am co-hosting the Summer Garden Tea Party hosted by Shanji of Shanji Home Decor and Lifestyle. And the other co-hosts are Tammy of Glam Queen of DIY and Andrea of Andrea Mason's The Queen's Court. Alright guys, in my creation, I'm going to show you how to incorporate the color of red, of course green. So my inspiration it is the old country roses of Royal Albert and the thrifted items which is also the lamp and of course my Eiffel Tower. So this one I call this one Parisian uh, versus English tea party. Alright everyone, let's get it started. Alright everyone, so right now this is what's going on in my table. So I'm gonna reuse this red tablecloth that I used for a 4th of July. On top of that, I'm also gonna use this lace tablecloth from Steve's mom. And I'm going to start from this one. As you see over there, the other lace over here is a little bit more there, but you can uh, see it later when I put my my uh, garland there. This garland I used this many times in tea party tablescape. I used this one in Mother's Day tablescape last year, my very first one. And I also use this one on the Valentine's. All I do is I just change the flowers. So the red roses flowers came from Dollar Store. I use the red roses on our Valentine series. And I believe it is the finale series. I will drop the link of my playlist of the Valentine series. You guys probably get some inspiration over there because that one is very unique and it's very non-traditional. So by next year, you have an idea how to create yours. Same thing with my tea party tablescape. I will drop the playlist link. I made a playlist link for my tea party tablescape. And I hope you check it out. And let me know what you like on that tea party tablescape. This red roses came from Dollar Store. Everyone, this is very high end look to me. Uh, it looks like velvet, so I can't believe that Dollar Store has a very high-end item when it comes to red roses. And I use this one many times as well. This third tray a Royal Albert I thrifted for five dollars so what I'm gonna do I will take out those uh, handle there and I'm going to put that on the top of another third tray as a centerpiece this one is also thrifted from American Cancer Society Guys, after you watch my video, please go over to the host channel and the other co-host channel and tell them I sent you.
And here is my latest vintage antique hunt. And I really love this ruby and brass red lamp. Charger is thrifted from the Goodwill and it was a Lennox brand. And I used this many times. And here's my Royal Albert dinnerware that I love so much. My bunny teapot is also a Royal Albert. Welcome to my table number one. I call this one English Tea Party featuring Old Country Roses Royal Albert Dinnerware. Look at this pattern of Queen Anne. It's very beautiful, everyone. I love it. Small teaspoon from Goodwill. The big silverware came from Antique Store. Napkin ring is thrifted. And here is my vintage slum. It is a brass and a ruby. It's very, very pretty in person and it's really heavy. So I would like to shout out the owner of this slump in Antique Unique store and I bought that from him. Stay tuned this coming Monday. I'm going to have my big thrifting hauls and these pieces I will show you it's very rare and it's very hard to find I just want you I just need you I don't know what it is you do I just want you I just need you I don't know what it is you do here I use the petals from the dollar store that one from Valentine's and top of that I have my little cute teapot over there that came from Hobby Lobby in the clearance section. My napkin from the trip store and I don't know what flower is this one and oh my god guys I'm so in love with the pattern of Royal Albert Old Country Roses.
such a wonderful delight Forgo Give up everything that I own Yeah, I'd give it all up now Just to be with you somehow Unexpected love was found You're the rose in a garden and here's my table number two in Parisian team. I hope you enjoy. So what do you think? I'm pretty good hiding those cable wire. Can you see? <laughs> this one is stripped. This is stripped right here. Drifted. This is came from Steve's mom. Steve's mom's a gift on my birthday. This is thrifted. This is thrifted. Royal Albert Dollar Store. This one is also from Antique Store. And this one also is thrifted. So majority of the item I use here are thrifted. The one is thrifted. The only thing is not thrifted is that teapot right there. Uh, this one I bought from Facebook Marketplace. I have to drive an hour to get those and it's very cheap. I negotiate, uh, she sold it for $150, but I negotiate, uh, she, she gave it to me for $125, it's four settings. Shout out to Becky, the owner of this Royal Albert dinner plates. Thank you so much for your kindness and you give this to me for a very good price. And I hope you like what I did in this table settings for a Royal Albert. Guys, don't forget to stop by at the host channel, Shanji of Home Decor and Lifestyle, Tammy of The Glam Queen of DIY, and Andrea of Andrea Mason's The Queen's Court. 
they are also the co-host of this collaboration and also guys don't forget to watch the playlist so that you can watch all the participants creation and if you like my videos i hope you consider subscribing to my channel hit the bell twice so every time i upload videos you will be notified everyone you can follow me in instagram at glamour ellen my facebook is also glamour ellen and please if you can share my videos likes comments i really appreciate to all my subscribers all over the world thank you so much for watching my videos and to all content creators and all the participants who joining us in this collaboration thank you guys so much and i hope to see you next time bye bye